was a long journey home for 25 year old Staff Sergeant Vernon W. Martin at St. John Baptist Church, a somber scene as military pallbearers carried the flag draped coffin inside. Nearby family members waited in silence, saying their goodbyes. Inside, the silence changed to song and worship as Martin's life was remembered, first by Gail Brown, his counselor at Johnson High School. As we reflect and remember Vernon's life, we again honor him, honor his family, honor the legacy that he, left, he has left. He has paid that ultimate sacrifice. We can all, and we do all, look to the day when such sacrifices will not be necessary. Congressman John Barrow and State Senator Lester Jackson was here. So was Brigadier General Jennifer Knapper. Staff Sergeant Martin's personal courage and commitment to mission accomplishment in a combat zone under the most extreme of circumstances greatly contributed to the defeat of terrorism. Martin was awarded the Purple Heart and Bronze Star for his actions in the battle that took his life. When they were presented to his wife, Brittany, she and many others inside the church found that tears were a necessary part of this day. It was a flag-draped coffin, and many here saying it's a grateful country.